Right, let's get started with these modals. Yes, modality. Right, we're going to have some grammar, um, not grammar terminology, but you know, one way that some people explain this. I think um, working with modals, you've just got to understand the meaning and the use, haven't you, really? Anyway, let's have a look at language focus, modals and related verbs. And it says, test your grammar. Modal verbs have many meanings. Match the sentences to their meanings. And I will go through the answers with you. But what what are we using these modal verbs for? Permission, saying to somebody, you, you can do this, you're allowed to. Advice, telling somebody your recommendation. Obligation, saying that something is necessary. Okay. Ability, yeah, that uh, you are able to do something. Willingness or unwillingness, you want to do it or you don't really want to do it. Probability or possibility, how likely is it? Okay, so we're going to read through these ones. She can ski very well. And I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to put up the answers as we go through. She can ski very well. What do you think? That's her ability, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. And it says D, ability. Well done. You did really well there. Can I park in your drive? Now, of course, that's not about the ability. Well, I don't know if you can park in my drive. Uh, my colleague Vicky would say last time I tried to park in her drive, it looked very silly. So uh, <laughs> actually, she didn't see me, but uh, it was. It was a nightmare. Anyway, uh, yes, I can park <laughs> badly. Uh, but of course, that's permission, isn't it? Yeah. You must have a driving license. That's your obligation. Yeah. They must be in love. That's their obligation. No, of course not. You're having a guess, aren't you? Yeah. And if you're guessing something, we use must for probability. Remember the thing I said? What's that sound? Oh, it must be the postman. Uh, we must get an early night tonight. Now, is that an obligation? The sleep police will come and arrest you if you don't get to bed early tonight. No, of course not. That one is your obligation. OK, yeah. Yeah. So basically, in this case, you must have a driving license or you're not allowed to drive this car. We must get an early night tonight. Where's the obligation coming from, though? It's not coming from an outside source. It's coming from you inside, isn't it? Yeah. You should stop seeing him. Well, that's obviously a recommendation. Um, seeing him in this sense means um, going out with somebody to be in a relationship with somebody. OK. You can say, are you seeing anyone at the moment? Which means, are you going out with anybody? Do you have a boyfriend or girlfriend? Uh, I'll help. Or I'll help you. I won't help you. Again, will is a modal verb. And that one is? Yep. Willingness. Yeah, you want to. I will is willingness. Hmm, easy, isn't it? Yeah. It might snow tonight. It will probably snow on Tuesday. Um, so if you're listening to this on Tuesday... Who knows, it might snow tonight. And that one, yep, again, probability. It's not quite as strong, is it? He may be coming later. And again, probability or possibility. People say, what's the difference between may and might? I think we can say may is a slightly bigger chance than might, okay? I may go to the supermarket this weekend. It's possible I could do it. It might snow at the weekend. It's possible, but not quite as possible. OK, so hopefully you did OK with that one. After this, uh, we can work it out. Look at the photos and what do you think the people are talking about? Oh, look, trouble. <laughs> oh, look, bigger trouble. Oh, even bigger trouble. He's been rammed by a larder. <laughs> Where do they get these photos from? Anyway, um, right, read and listen to the conversations A and B and underline those modal verbs. So the nine that exist along here. And what are the meanings of them? OK, and I'm going to put up the answers in five, four, three, two, one. Here they come. You should swallow your pride. I will not. You'll have to. You can't. I might. I can. It must. You can't. Who says I can't? Can't you read? I couldn't, could I? You should get your eyes tested. You should. You should get your eyes tested. You should. <laughs> yeah, let's just repeat it to make sure the person accepts the recommendation. Okay, that's the end of this one. We'll do the next part in the next video.